High School Musical 2 is on at the Opera House until Saturday. And two of the stars, Ian Reddington and Liam Doyle, join me now. Guys, hello and welcome. Hi. Now, excuse my ignorance, I haven't seen High School Musical or High School Musical 2 because I don't have children. So, would I be able to come and watch it and still enjoy it at my age? Yes. 28 well, ish. Well, well, I'm in it and I'm 29 ish. <laughs> so, you, you, you'd be fine there. So, who do you play in it? Uh, I play Mr. Fulton. Right. Who is, um, who is the general manager of um, the, the big country um, park where, the, where all the kids come to for their summer vacation. And this has been a tough gig for you, hasn't it? Because you've <laughs> stepped in at the last minute. They're all, they're all t tough gigs. Yeah, yeah. I I'm just stepping in, really. It's almost like doing a panto for me just over the, the Christmas period. So it, it was like jumping on a fa onto a fast-moving roundabout with all these guys working really hard. I just jumped in and did my bit. Last night was my first night. So normally it's been Les Dennis... Les, Les, it's normally Les. I'm stepping in for him just for this for this Christmas period. And so, how was last night? It was it bordered from chaos to sublime, <laughs> depending <laughs> at, depending at which point you saw what I was doing. But you enjoyed it. It was great. So, Liam, I'll bring you in at this point. Do you now? The one person I do know is Zac Efron, and he yes. plays Troy. Is that right? Yeah, is that's that who right. you play? Yeah, I'm, I play Troy. Oh, are all the girls swooning <laughs> when you come on. I mean, it's yeah. Hot. <laughs> come on. A little bit. It's, it's nice. It's always nice because when we run on stage, we get to wave to the audience, and we always get a good cheer and scream when we run on. So it's kind of, it's nice to have that, I guess, as a boost. As once you run on, you get confidence straight away. And what sort of ages are in the audience? Um, it ranges because it's a family show. You get a lot of an age range. So you'll have kids as young as four or five, and then their grandparents with them. So it's kind of, with the show, it's got something for everyone, because the music's really strong. It's when, you see, it's when you see people there without kids, and you think, is that strange or not? <laughs> no, people do come. People just yeah. turn up and People see like musical theatre. Yeah, and it's high. Oh, talking of which, a bit of musical theatre now. This looks fantastic. See, I would enjoy this. Yeah. I would love this. Of course, you won't see me, because this is highly energetic. Oh, so you're not in the dance <laughs> this, is, bit. this is what all the kids do. No, no, I just turn up, I do a little bit of acting, retire gracefully, and let the kids go absolutely berserk. It's the really? perfect job, really. And if you haven't, I know this might sound ridiculous, because obviously this is a sequel. If you haven't seen the first one, can you still come and see this one? It makes sense. Yeah, definitely. Um, at the beginning of the show, we, it's kind of like a recap of the first film. So you get the story right up until our show starts. And then our show is very different as well, because it's about like a summer vacation. So it's very separate to the first and the third films. So it can stand so it, It's got its own story. It's not, it's not continuous. It's got its own message and everything. So if you see it, you can, you can enjoy it. Self-indulgent question for me. Please go back into Coronation Street. Your character was phenomenal. If I had a pound for everyone, <laughs> I said, please, they stop me in the street, they go back, please, they beg of it. Um, Would you go back into a big soap like that again? Uh, listen, Corey, never say never, yeah. as Kevin Keegan you, said. Corey, Corey was great, a lovely set of people. Yeah. And then EastEnders before that. So and then EastEnders just, before that, yeah. yeah. I suppose a gig's a gig, isn't it, at the end of the day? A, a gig is a gig, but Corey was great, was, yeah. was special. I thought your character's phenomenal. And, and what, what's your acting background? Is this new to you, straight into theatre, or...? Oh, well, uh, I entered a GMTV competition to win the part of Troy. So I'm only 18, well, I'm 19 tomorrow. But um, I had to do this competition to get this part. So this is my first job. It's the first time I've worked in professional theatre. Yeah. <laughs> well, Literally, you look no, after him. No, it, yeah. and it's fantastic. I mean, a lot of the cast are doing their first, maybe their second jobs. I mean, just... and it's. Fantastic to watch that energy and that right. well, commitment. Good luck with it all. Happy birthday for tomorrow. Thank Tickets you. are still available and you're on in Manchester till Saturday. So Indeed. thanks very much, Thank guys. You. Thank you.